hi guys today I'm going to show you how to create a bone based animation in unity I'm using my character as stickman I have created my character I have childed everything and set up everything for animating I have created the animation controller and attached it to my stickman now it's time to create animations for it so we'll create animation and name it as stickman underscore idle sorry <laughs> idle so that sounds okay now we have to add the frame idle is this so we will add property which is the transform of stickman and higher properties like position position is I think not ok so we will start with properties like where we are going to start animating a stickman so what's the idle state is like firstly this like this this is the idle state <laughs> looks pretty and the hand also so we will move the hand the leg and again the leg so this is the idle so let's see it I think that's fine so we have created this now let's save our work now we are going to create other animation which is this is the default animation it's okay we are going to create new clip which is stick math underscore walk so now what we are going to do is select our stick man set then clip walk now in this clip what we are going to do is at 10 frame let's say upper leg moves like this lower portion sometimes messy just like this you have to rotate this also and this torso upper arm this arm like goes like this lower portion of this arm goes like this that's just a transform this arm goes like this this part goes like this and just a little bit so I think that is good now oh shit man we forgot <laughs> to use this key so we'll insert all the properties let's do it from the start i don't think there is other, any other option so i'll do it from the start uh, this leg like this this portion like this we'll move it this leg like this lower upper arm lower piece
Now guys, I don't know why, but it's changed its dimensions every time. So if you know any reason for this, please let me know. So this is our position getting in the position. Now what we're going to do, this is at 10 at 20 what we're going to do is move this backward move this frontward let's go there now it will look of course because we are moving the positions up it seems okay now at this we also want to like this why does this happen i don't know i don't have a solution for this but i think if any of you guys know this please let me know now we'll rotate this rotate this again it happens again we will fix this like this so I think now yes now it's good so now what we'll do we will copy other frames this this next frame will be this so we'll copy all the frames in this control plus C control plus V now it looks like control plus C control plus V actually we don't want this this is just from going to going from idle to run we will talk about this in a completely different animation so from the we want animation from this not from this so just we'll create another clip for this and we will call it shifting from idle state to running state so let's save our work now stickman idle it goes to work when it goes directly to work it's not look great so we'll create another clip we will call stickman underscore going from idle to work now in this we want this proper so why does that happen I don't know sometimes we want both so let's copy all the clip control plus C from idle to work control plus V now I think it is good as far as good so we'll delete these keyframes now we'll shift all other keyframes to 0 now that's a running anim that's a running animation let's play it thing he's running not working so now he will walk yes that's a smooth so and it save the work now 
how we are going to maintain this so walking depends on input a stick man idle goes from this transition to this when he starts to and this to this so let's check this out I have created a rigid I have added a rigid body to it and added gravity so let's remove rigid body from it no box collider is attached so we will create another 2d object 3d what you want to make 2d object is right create man and another sprint yes this this is i think this is good let's resize it its sorting layer is zero which is this i have created one and minus one so that when we have a character which has colors and other details so the the right hand is on the back side of the left hand and the head is on the middle so we will add box collider to it now i think it should work Now let's see this. Oh, sorry, not simulated. Sorry, gravity is zero. Simple. <laughs> so now it looks nice why it goes down because the gravity of a stick man is not zero now what will happen i think that's nice so that's all for this video guys in next video we are going to attach scripts to this stick man so when we play the so when we press arrows and arrows then it will it will trans it will transition from idle state to walk state so thank you guys for watching and hope you like this video